Hello my friends. Here is a wiring diagram for the boat. And when I first started the boat, the only thing that was hooked up was the bilge pump and the starter motor. This has just about everything that's needed onto the boat. Looking at this diagram, first thing that I want to show you here is the running lights. Okay, this switch turns on the running lights, which would include the red and green light on the bow and the white light on the stern. Okay, when you're at anchor, you don't want your red green light on, you just want the white stern light. So this circuit here, I'm using a diode as a switching device, and what this will do is switch the lights either dual or just the stern light. And the diode that's being used is a 1N4001. Okay, to turn the stern light on, there is a switch right here just for the anchor. And this switch here can, turns on both of them, and that is the running light. And this area right here is what I'm going to show you how I wired this and how this circuit works. Here's a little bench setup. I'm going to verify that uh, this circuit indeed works. So I have two LED strips. One will represent the anchor light. The other will uh, represent the running lights. So when I connect, <clears throat> this would be the switch. Connect on the left side. They both light. Connect on the right side. Only the anchor light would come on. One light, two lights. Simple logic circuit, one LED. I'm using a 1N4001. That's a one amp diode. Notice the size. Got to be physical to be able to handle uh, the current. Got to be physically large to be able to handle the current. And one amp is a very much overkill. Here is the running lights. Red, green, and the anchor light. And anchor light switch. When the running lights are on, the anchor light stays on. Anchor light by itself. Running light and anchor light. Hope this video was informative. Thanks for watching, my friends. Bye-bye.